Okay, cooking with grump. We got our uh, pizza set out. We use Boboli pizza crusts here. And then next, we uh, use some olive oil here. And we spread that around with the brush. Get that nice and slathered up. Next comes the Casavisco sauce. Spread that around with a spoon. Now we're on the uh, Sargento mozzarella cheese. Shredded. Now we're gonna use uh, two Sargento mozzarella cheeses on this thing, but first, because you notice that it's just, it's kind of thin for one pound of cheese. Is that one pound of cheese? That is, sorry, half pound of cheese. So we're gonna use a full pound of cheese. That's eight ounces, so we're gonna use a full pound of cheese on this pizza. First what I want to do was, next comes the mushrooms, sliced mushrooms, then we're also going to use sliced olives, so these are our two toppings right here, let me show you how we're going to put those on specifically. Alright, we're going to do two layers of toppings. First layer of cheese, and then uh, this is going to be buried under the uh, other layer of cheese. And uh, it's going to be a great pizza. So let's get these nice and spread out here. If you put too many olives on it, in my experience, I've thrown up in the past from probably both the way the olives were stored and the amount of olives. It just doesn't sit well. So you put a small amount that your body can handle. Try it for yourself. It'll ruin your pizza experience having too much olives. Great texture, great flavor, but it just made me vomit one time. Several hours after and it was not digesting. All right, top of the second layer of cheese and then the second layer of toppings. Get that cheese loosened up. Now we're just gonna sprinkle it on there. All right. Gonna spread it over the first layer of toppings without shifting them around. Spread it nice and even. You want to cover the whole first layer of topping so you can do a second nice even layer all right uh -huh. all right second layer of toppings Gonna stick it in the oven for 10 minutes at 450 degrees. Okay, the pizza is done. 
take her out of the oven and that looks nice right there very nice let's get you all a little close up Gotta show you something real quick. You're gonna love this. K bar pizza cutter. Just like the combat knife from Project Reality. It's got the same K bar handle grooves. It's got a great grip on it. And, uh, works great. Now, when you cut a pizza, you gotta go back and forth a little bit. Back and forth, back and forth, all the way across. You don't just go one line otherwise it's not going to come come apart so many uh pizza shop workers mess that up 